Crawl through the mud like a pig. Uh, you can walk through the mud like a human being. You know what I mean. And also, I'm a fox, not a human. Angsty lady, you just need to calm what? down. What? Angsty what? lady. Don't you just say to me, you annoying, gross young man. Angsty lady. You stop it. Don't Angsty walk me. Lady. Mad Hello. again. Well, she's gonna you? always like that. We've gotta make sure she's something good. That she won't kill us over. So what exactly would that be? Cheap. But she likes money, we've got to pick something decent. Oh. Wait a minute, Charizard, what's that? $7,000. What is that? Looks like bad news. Well, I'm on control, he's cheap. And it doesn't look good. Wait a minute, that dude's kind of creepy. That's super great. I have no idea. Look, uh, bald green men, they're worth a lot of money. They look like uh, pushovers. I think we can do something with them. Those are aliens. I thought they looked familiar. Mr. Ted, oh. we are leaving right now. Oh, well, we haven't picked a job yet. Dan, that teenager's hey, king. Hey, lady. He's sad for us. We're going to break all this stuff in this place. He's got a nice singing voice, kind of. Maybe no, some training. No, he doesn't. He's just making fun of me. He's mocking like him. Chief, what are you talking about? Look at him. He has a nice smile. I can barely even tell what it is. Looks like it was pretty ages ago. Well, maybe it was, but we can get $115. Listen here, Pinocchio reject. Uh, we want the mud kip. Bounty, all right? Now give it to us. All right, Granny, then how about you waddle your lazy rear over there and pull it off the board? <gasps> well, I never! Mr. Teddy, retrieve the mudkip. Okay, well, wouldn't Jeffrey help me out here? I tell you, I don't want to work here anymore. <gasps> the people here just suck. <gasps> I will be telling your uncle. Where is Booberry anyway? Yeah, go ahead. My uncle's gone. He left the shop with me, so, uh, with my an rules. With irresponsible angsty teen. Wow, great move. Mm-hmm, yeah, well, you know, at least I'm not a grandma. Listen here, you have insulted everything I hold dear, and I will hold you responsible. I'm just going to get out. Uh, sir, before you mm -hmm. go, come over here. I need to explain the uh, bounty posters. What's your name, Brett? William, but you can call me sir. Oh, now, sir? Uh, give me the poster. Uh-huh, yes, okay, I see you've picked a sun bounty. Let me explain the bounties. This is a good pick for y'all, I think. Day bounties are good for people like... They care. And what are you insinuating? Uh, quiet, I actually need to explain this. The sun bounty means that you're going to find this creature in the day, most likely. It also means that it's going to be easier than normal. Moon bounties, you'll probably need to find them at night. So there is danger associated with that. Then we've got ghoul bounties. Those are pretty self-explanatory, but we're dealing with supernatural, or uh, potentially supernatural entities. Uh, and finally, danger posters. Seeing as you're new, I can't let you take any of those, but in the future, if you're up for it, you're ready to risk your life. Oh, thank you, Mr. William. We'll just take the sun for now. Come on, woman, let's go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's having a bad day. Forgive her. She's not always like, I wonder why I'm having a bad day. <laughs> you know what? She actually is kind of always like this. <laughs> One more thing. There's another bounty type called Secret Bounty. If you ever become an S-plus adventurer, I'll tell you about those. But, I won't hold my breath. Aw, oh, Mr. T, that fox was so mean to me. You go around behind him and then we'll ambush him. Yeah, I'll go to hell with Oh, look! What's that over there? Oh, it's running! Get him, Jaybree! Uh, he's gone, Mr. Uh, Mr. Tank. Oh, Japer, I said to go after him. I was trying to flank. But you're not trying to flank me. You're trying to flank him. We can even both go that way at the same time. Yeah, but I was... I was and then... It was her fault. Japer, it was not my fault. Well, it wasn't my fault that I well, ran into the... Then the only uh, other person it could be was Mr. Tank. What's that? Uh, Over the tree. Uh, uh, it's the mud kit. Look like a different one to me. These woods are crawling with monsters. Suppose we'll find them eventually. There's so many things everywhere living in these woods. We don't have that long. Woman can only last like 30 minutes in the woods. I know. Um, woman, you know, you don't have to come with us in the woods if it's too much for you. What are you talking about, no, Mr. Just, Day? it's too much for you. You don't need to come out of the woods. Of course I hate the woods, but I won't leave you two out here. You're helpless without me. 
Yeah, are we? Okay. That's what you said. Uh, okay. Where did you tell us that? Oh, I, I don't right, do remember. Oh. <laughs> you hear that? It's a mermaid. I can hear you. Could you the middle of the woods? Oh. And if a mermaid sounds like that, you need to run. It's hideous. What is that? Maybe it's like a swamp mermaid. Oh. I'll bet that's Mudkip. Kind of looks like a frog. Frogs sing. Yeah, there's a lot of foxes, but no one likes it. Especially orange foxes. Just get over it, woman. I'm coming for me! Jeepers! It's a mermaid! It's some old freak! That's an ugly old freak. Nice water. You know it. Oh, I'm gonna... Mr. be quiet, we're stalking. I'm sorry, I'm trying to breathe. Shh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Get the net. Oh, we don't have a net. <laughs> well, how are we supposed to catch on this today? What was the plan? Uh, uh, I've no idea. But isn't it a bit odd that they've got a swimming pool? You're yeah, right. Kind of weird. Let's just go have a chat with them. Oh, maybe they're civilized. Why in the world are they on a bounty post? Civilized? You impersonated a mermaid! Mm. Hello there, <laughs> gentlemen. Uh, Hello. We're coming to peace. Peace? Hmm? It's the spinning image of them. You're under arrest, mud trip. Shut up, Tapery. Oh, arrest? <laughs> Is this about my taxes? Oh, no. Calm down, Mr. Duck. We mean no harm. Oh, uh, you don't? Well, what are you doing? Sneak it up on us in the woods. That ain't right. He talks, he talks. I know he talks. That ain't no monster. It's a man. Are you trying to say about my taxes? I don't pay taxes, so I thought they'd come for me. We don't have anything to do with it, woman. Now stop that. He's mine! He's mine! Oh, it's out! Look out! It's out! No, no, oh. take me alive! Oh. Yes, Griffin! <laughs> Stay still. Oh, Trying to help you here. Get off my face. My dream got away. It's not my fault though. I was distracted. There was a pretty butterfly. And, uh. Woman, you should probably get out of there. You'll get wrinkles. Mr. Dad, yeah. I can't. I can't. I'm going to look like a magic snow leopard now. Uh, it'll never be the same. I mean, you're not wrong, but uh, who are you, sir? <laughs> Me? <laughs> I'm Yoda. He doesn't look anything like Yoda. Who are you really? I'm Yoda. But he didn't look like him. Yeah, but like, who are you really? You Yoda. Like Yoda. Just saying. Yoda, I am. Oh no, Yoda, I see. Listen here, you dark-faced muffin. <laughs> Where's the the mudkip? The one who was with you? The one I trapped in this stupid puddle to get? You want Yoda to rat out on his friends? Yoda's not a rat like you! She looks like this, she recognizes me! Oh my god! You gotta find my gift! You gotta find a secret land! Oh, oh bless, he's gone again. We should work on her cardio. You wanna jog in the mornings? You're older there, will you? Maybe you could just start trying. Look at me, I'm sucking Oh wet. my goodness! I tried hard. We've been out here more than 30 minutes. <laughs> we should probably go back. At least I'm not hot. <laughs> this is it! I look like a freshly licked cow! You know, from this angle, you're not wrong! Uh, well, man, we're gonna get out of the woods and everything's gonna be okay. And we won't bring you anymore, I'm okay? I'm tired! Oh. And I'm hungry! And I'm hungry! Oh. And I don't feel good! And you, I'm, you want Jeffrey to look for some grub? Oh. So we need a new coat for woman. We need to work on her cardio. We should probably buy a gun because we're completely defenseless. We need a map, maybe a GPS. I don't know. Does anyone have a brain? We can use one of those too. That's very snarky coming from you, Ghost Runner. Oh. A strange man. Oh my! Uh, Pika. Oh, Mr. T, he's not a man. He's a child. You poor thing. Where your parents tell us all about Where's it. Where's your mummy and your daddy? <laughs> You're scared. <laughs> Parents, I'm a full-grown man and a detective at that from Pokey City. Listen, what's Pokey City? Is that a way to get all these stupid ones? 
I highly doubt it. Uh, good day. Where's Pokey City? Where are you from? Oh, we're from Brushton, a little town nearby. We decided to come out in the woods. Oh, would you try come to make some coin? Oh. Yeah. Look, we're a bit lost right now, not gonna lie. Yeah. Could you lead us to the road? Well, she's not gonna last much longer. Oh, well, I'll lead you out then, this way. So, little boy, uh, what's your name, huh? I'm Pikachu. Okay. And I'm that little boy. I'm a detective. No, oh, what do you detect, Metal? <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. No, see, I've been investigating. In Pokey City, there's been, well, crimes. Evil people about trying to steal the citizens and steal imprison them. them. Well, that sounds like a big deal. It is. That's why I'm on the case, Detective Pikachu. Hey, don't worry. We're not bad people. We're good people. We work for the adventure company. Yeah. What? The, the, the. <laughs> Top of that, oh, I itch oh, everywhere. Yeah, so oh, oh, what's the yeah. chair? They're getting away. Huh? Run, run after them. Go. Uh, I, don't, I just don't think I have any. Guys, nothing. Come back. 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 Oh. I need to go to the dry cleaners. Oh. Ow. Too much for me. Oh, it's much better oh. actually. It's a day. Oh, wet and itchy. It's definitely odd. Hmm. You know, I've heard some of the other adventurers talk about that, but are you sure it wasn't that granny? She has such a bad attitude. Who's that? That lady woman that I was talking to earlier. No, I just makes a little sense. They were all running scared. And everybody's talking about a hidden village or something? Pokey Park? Pokeville? Poke Town? Uncle Booberry has received similar reports, which is why we have pictures of all these suspicious people. We're hoping to speak to them, but, uh, I can't really tell you anything. Other than, uh, well, I guess I should. Some of the other adventurers have gone out to check on those woods, and, uh, so far we haven't heard back from them. Oh, man. Why didn't you tell us that earlier? Seems like you probably should have told us that. I just work the counter. Uncle Booberry is in charge of everything else. So, I'm sure they're fine. Uh, some of our adventurers, they, they're not very good at communication, and, well, uh, I mean, I've been calling them for weeks. They just won't answer. But I will say, something weird about those woods. We should rename them the Weird Woods. That's very creative of you. Uh, but uh, we were unable to find Mudkip, but we lost our poster. Don't worry, these things happen. I do hope you have a good day. Thanks for coming in. How much gonna break if we don't get out there? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> stop, stop. Hey there, kid. How's it shaking? Where's your old man? Yeah. Uncle Booberry's away today. Who are you? Well, you know, just some old friends. Oh, oh. Not that way. We just know him a long time. We know him a long time. Guess I'll let him know that you stopped by. Don't do that. Yeah, you wanna buy anything? We have a wing ton toilet. Oh, is this it? That's the one. Oh, I like You okay. break it, you buy it. I didn't, I didn't break it, I was touching it. So let's get down to the brass tacks, the beads wax, the knickknacks. Yeah. And what are those? I wanna file a bounty on my wife. She's been acting weird lately. You won't talk to me. Could you go on mine while we're at it? Yeah, and what exactly are people supposed to do once they find your wife? Uh, I, I already know where she is. It's just a matter of talking some sense into her. We are Look respectable, it. Yeah, gentlemen. we're respectable. There's really no reason that a wife shouldn't talk to us. I guess I'll give you some empty forms to fill out. Do you have pictures? Oh, oh uh, I'll draw mine. It's fine. And we're not the moon one. She's always on the prowl. Yeah, I didn't want any dangerous ones. My wife feels scary. I'll get you guys some pencils. No! Thank you. Uh, I need me a crayon. I'll do my best drawing with a crayon. Thanks for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed the episode. We had a lot of fun filming it. Mm -hmm. And you know, at the end, we normally tell you that we love you and that God loves you. But let's see what the Bible says about that, just so y'all can head to receipts for that. This is what it says in the book of Romans, chapter 5, verse 8. It says, For while we were still helpless, at the right time Christ mm -hmm. died for the ungodly. 
the people who didn't want anything to do with God. For one will hardly die for a righteous man, though perhaps for the good man someone would dare even to die. It's but true. God demonstrates his own love toward us and that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. Mm-hmm. See guys, he loves us and redeems us even though we don't deserve it. That's pretty interesting. It's not like we do good things and God's like, oh, I like that guy. <laughs> no, it's not yeah. how it happens. God says, you suck, and but I love you. And how much he loved us. Yeah. That we died for somebody who did deserve it. That's why it's amazing. So when we say that, mm-hmm. remember that. Remember how much he loves you. But we love you, mm-hmm. and he loves you too. See you later. Bye-bye. Bye. This is a question. Who looks more like the president? Him or him? Me. Give me a. Where? The one behind you. Hey, this nobody. This is the President Billiam. Hey, yeah, all the man in the man. Every hour of the year. Okay, all right, you know oh, what? His face is so fat. It looks exactly like him. No, no. You fat headed it, freak. I mean, <laughs> I think President Bill I am is the best president and his father Bill I was <laughs> and and then his son what's his name? Bill I will be. Bill yeah. will be. Yeah, Bill will be will be the next president. Most likely. Honey. Honey. How about I be a southern belt? <laughs> you get learning all the problem. Oh, you get learning all the problem. We go down the road at home. Bye.